Hi, this is Graham Kent from the Nevada Seismological Laboratory. We're going to use a fire that just uh, started a little before 3 p.m. today uh, near Spooner Summit to take advantage of uh, how we can use two cameras to locate a fire. Right now you're looking at the uh, Snow Valley camera pointing to the south and we can do a little time lapse uh, for the last hour or so and we can see how Camino has pointed the cameras uh, down towards the actual incident. That's for the last uh, hour, and we can also head on over to Homewood and see the progress of the fire from Homewood, and also time lapse that. In this case, maybe we'll do 15 uh, minutes, and we can see how it's going there. Now, if we look over to our uh, our uh, right, there's our nifty uh, map with our cameras and some options, and if we go up to the upper right, you can see how we can turn camera targets on and off. So we're gonna keep them on. Um, we have lightning intensity and camera field view, uh, but right now we're more interested in making sure that the camera target is punched in and checked. Now if we go down and right click at the intersection of Snow Valley and Homewood, we're going to get a latitude and longitude. And that's where the fire is located right now, it's near Spooner Lake, and that would give you the coordinates uh, of the fire since both the Homewood camera and the Snow Valley Peak camera are centered on the fire itself. Anyhow, uh, we'll continue, continue to watch the progress of this fire on Alert Tahoe this afternoon, but thought we'd use this opportunity to show you how we can actually uh, use two cameras to locate a fire with this uh, user interface. Have a great day.